Is it time to buy or sell Microsoft stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Microsoft. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, the 22nd of October, 2024. And now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered financial advice. Since the 21st of October, 2024, our system has classified Microsoft as a hold or accumulate, assigning it a score of 0 0.4. Now, let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. The stock has experienced natural fluctuations, resulting in a gain of 2.08%. This equates to an average return of 1.04% per day since it was categorized as hold or accumulate. The stock is currently moving within a broad and horizontal trend, and further fluctuations within this trend are anticipated. The existing three-month trend indicates a potential change of 1.46% over the upcoming three months, with a possible return ranging from negative 4.93% to positive 4.65%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it points to a change of 16.64% over the next year, with a potential return between 8.26% and 33.33%. This suggests a price range of $462.81 to $569.99 after one year. Our latest daily update for Microsoft includes the headline, Green day on Tuesday for Microsoft stock after gaining just over 2%. The Microsoft stock price increased by just over 2% on the last trading day Tuesday, the 22nd of October, 2024, rising from $418.78 to $427.51. It has now gained for four consecutive days. It will be interesting to see whether it continues to rise or takes a brief pause in the coming days. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated by 3%, with a low of $418.05 and a high of $430.57. The price has increased in seven of the last 10 days and has risen by just over 3% in the past two weeks. Trading volume also increased on the last day, which is a positive technical indicator, with a total of 11 million more shares traded than the previous day. In total, 24 million shares were bought and sold, amounting to approximately $10,200,000,000. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price reached was $468.35, while the lowest was $326.94. Currently, the price is 8.72%, or $40.84, below the 52-week high of $468.35, which is also the all-time high for the stock. Microsoft is making headlines today with a blend of developments that could influence its stock performance in both the short and long term. Firstly, an investigation has been initiated by Levi and Korsinski concerning potential data interception during Xbox video game transactions. This scrutiny may create uncertainty among investors, potentially affecting stock prices as concerns about data security increase. On a brighter note, Microsoft has chosen Opaque for its startup's Pegasus program, enhancing Opaque's capacity to deliver secure artificial intelligence solutions. This partnership is expected to elevate Microsoft's innovation profile, potentially attracting more investors interested in its AI endeavors. Furthermore, the tech giant is set to be a significant buyer of NVIDIA's Blackwell platform, indicating strong demand for advanced technology resources, which may further fortify Microsoft's competitive advantage in the market. 
Microsoft's participation in a $10 million AI initiative with OpenAI also highlights its commitment to advancing AI in local journalism, potentially enhancing its brand reputation and creating new revenue streams. Additionally, Microsoft's inclusion in discussions about highly recommended dividend growth stocks underscores its stability, making it an appealing choice for risk-averse investors. However, with the rising competition from Amazon-backed Anthropic in the AI sector, Microsoft must remain vigilant. In summary, today's news presents a mixed outlook for Microsoft, encompassing both potential risks and opportunities. While short-term volatility may stem from the investigation, the long-term prospects appear promising as it continues to innovate and strengthen its collaborations. Analyst Ratings On Tuesday, the 22nd of October, 2024, it was reported that Loop Capital Markets assigned Microsoft a buy grade while taking a hold action. On the same day, the 22nd of October, 2024, it was reported that Evercore ISI rated Microsoft as outperform with a hold action. On Friday, the 18th of October, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush rated Microsoft as underperform and also took a hold action. On that same Friday, the 18th of October, 2024, Wells Fargo assigned Microsoft a buy grade while opting for a hold action. Additionally, on Friday, the 18th of October, 2024, Piper Sandler rated Microsoft as overweight and also chose a hold action. Analysts have assigned Microsoft stock a general buy rating. They classify the price to earnings ratio as a strong sell and the price to book ratio as strong sell. In terms of return on investment, the analysts have awarded the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for Microsoft. The Microsoft stock shows buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, suggesting a positive outlook for the stock. However, there is a general sell signal indicated by the relationship between these two averages, where the long-term average is positioned above the short-term average. During any downward corrections, support levels are expected around $419.31 and $421.56. A decline below either of these levels will trigger sell signals. A buy signal was generated from a pivot bottom point October 7, 2024, and since then, the stock has increased by 4.39%. Further upward movement is anticipated until a new top pivot is established. Additionally, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MXED. Trading volume is also rising alongside the price, which is considered a strong technical indicator. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, buy signal from 12 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal from 24 days ago. Short-term moving average, buy signal from four days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal from two days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages indicates a buy signal from 13 days ago. If we examine the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal from two days ago, long-term moving average, sell signal from 19 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages indicates a buy signal from 53 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to discover more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Microsoft Microsoft finds support from accumulated volume at $418.35. This level may present a buying opportunity, as an upward reaction can be anticipated when the support is tested. Generally, the stock exhibits controlled movements, and with good liquidity, the risk is considered very low. Over the last day, the stock experienced a movement of $12.52, between its high and low points, which corresponds to a change of 3%. For the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 1.63%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for Microsoft, let's take a moment to discuss some essential fundamental data. First, we have the price to earnings ratio, commonly known as the PE ratio, 
This important metric compares a company's current share price to its earnings per share. This P.E. ratio is relatively standard, typically observed in companies with established histories or predictable revenue streams. In other news, the upcoming earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 30th of October, 2024. Analysts are projecting consensus estimates at $3.08. It's important to monitor these figures as they can significantly influence stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Microsoft. In the event of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Microsoft is at $428.90. If you do not own any shares, it may be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could serve as a consideration for swing trading. On the downside, Microsoft faces its first support level at $418.35. If this support level holds, it could present a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Microsoft from multiple analyst sources is to buy. Now, let's examine some recent insider trades. On the 16th of September, 2024, Numoto Takishi conducted an insider purchase of 8,511 shares of common stock. On the same day, young Christopher David conducted an insider purchase of 8,990 shares of common stock. Also on that day, Smith Bradford L. conducted an insider purchase of 23,374 shares of common stock. Hood Amy made a similar insider purchase of 23,374 shares on that date. Lastly, Hogan Kathleen T. conducted an insider purchase of 7,912 shares on the 16th of September, 2024. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've determined that insider power is positive, reflected in a ratio of 6.657. In total, insiders purchased 543,109 shares while selling 488,476 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $406.52, reflecting a decrease of 4.91%. This stock exhibits very low daily movements, resulting in minimal risk. Additionally, there is a buy signal generated from a pivot bottom identified 11 days ago. Is Microsoft stock a good buy? Microsoft displays several positive indicators, yet we still do not consider these sufficient for a buy recommendation. At the current level, it is more appropriate to view it as a hold candidate, suggesting that investors should hold or accumulate while waiting for further developments. After examining the volatility and movements from the previous trading day, our analysis indicates that the current price appears to be overvalued. For trading on Wednesday, the 23rd of October, we anticipate that Microsoft will open down by $2.13, beginning its trading at $425.38. We remind you that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss, and it is advisable to consult with a financial advisor prior to making any decisions regarding the purchase or sale of securities. Your investment choices should not solely rely on the information provided by StockInvest.us. By accessing this information, you acknowledge and accept full responsibility for your own investment decisions. Here is our current perspective on the stock. We invite you to express your agreement or disagreement in the comments section below. What is your target for this stock? Don't forget to show your support by liking and subscribing. We wish you prosperous trading and hope you have a wonderful day with warm regards from everyone here at Stock Invest.